and everybody is set for this matchup between the Oakland Raiders and the Philadelphia Eagles here at Lincoln Financial Field. On paper, it looks like there are a lot of holes out there on that defense, especially against the run, and they're facing one of the top running teams today in the game. Yeah, it shows on paper that they struggle stopping a run, and it's a reality. They have struggled all year long, and today they better put some weights in their pocket because they're going to see a lot of runs right at them. Are they going to be strong enough to stand in there and take it? I don't know. Well, I'll have to see it to believe it. They need to get the playoff. The offense stops the clock right away with a timeout. Hey, let's go. The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. The offense pinned back in an awful position. Out of the gun. Looking for an open receiver on the right. That ball is picked off. He stacked up at that point. Nothing worse, though, as a quarterback to throw an interception early in the game. And you just kind of make sure you go over the, to the bench, you talk to yourself, keep your confidence up, and keep attacking. The defense is showing blitz here. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Challenging the defenders to the right side. The Raiders get a first down. There's a player down on the field. Trainers on their way out. Well, that's a good sight for all the fans to see. He gets up and walks off the field, and I think he's going to be okay. He's just going to need a couple minutes to catch his breath, and, and uh, we'll see him back on the field, it looks like, shortly. That reception gave them the first down. Now in rhythm, the quarterback drops back to throw once more. That catch, good for a first down. When you spy the quarterback, what it does, it just makes it easier to throw the football and complete those passes. Less people covering the receivers down the field. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. This is a screen play all the way. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. Well, it's a nice job by the receiver. Nowadays, you don't have to worry about taking hits high because of the rules of the NFL. you got to worry about the low hits. you got to learn to protect yourself. Good job that time by the receiver. Wide receivers bunched up. He drops back to throw. 
knocked down. Well, when you get in situations like this, third long, you've got to be smart on the offensive side. Yeah, I know you want to pick up the first down, but don't force it because if you do, it'll probably lead to a turnover. Five wides for the offense from the gun. The quarterback throws to the right. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Well, the offense has done a good job getting down inside the 20 in the so-called red zone or green zone by some teams. But the defense, you can be a little more aggressive now because you don't have to worry about the length of the field. It is shortened, so take advantage of it and attack this offense a little more. Play number six coming up on this drive. Darren McFadden will run with it. Going to lose yards here. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Second down and 12. Staying on the ground. And gains about one. Good job with the defensive line. Standing there and fighting. And they hold the running back to a short game. The quarterback's calling something out. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Trying to work the middle of the field. Open in the end zone. Nowadays, so many kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score touchdowns, they get to do dances, and you're not really allowed to hit them either. What a job. Raiders ready for action. Muscles to the defender. They face first down. The quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. On target. Eagles in for the score. Well, here we are. It's a tie game now. We'll see how the teams react to it. Will it be positive or negative? The Eagles for the extra point. The point after is good. They're lining up for the onside kick. They want to get the ball back. team has recovered. Raiders come onto the field for their next series. Offense lines up here. Now first and ten. McFadden. Dan picks up up out three. Well, a short gain on the run at time by the offense. When you're running football team, Listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. Second down and seven. The throw to the left. Almost went back the other way, but the defender could not hold on. They bunch up the receivers on one side. That's a pass all the way. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. This is what you call throwing a wide receiver open against man-to-man -man coverage. Throw it to the open space. Let the receiver outrun the defensive back. Nice completion. Here's the handoff to Darren McFadden. They load up one side with a whole flock of receivers looking to the right side and throwing. The ball's deflected incomplete. When you play man-to-man -man coverage, it takes a good throw and catch. That time, neither was there. Another incomplete pass.
Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. That catch gives them a first down. Dives across, and he's in for the touchdown. The wide receivers, they are turned into stars in the NFL, and you know why? Because they can make catches like this. What a great catch. Following the extra point, the Raiders are leading by seven. Sebastian Janikowski lining up for the kickoff. He's brought down. Here, a split backfield. First down and ten. He'll throw it over the middle. What a catch down the middle of the field. Well, you saw why defensive backs can't sleep the night before the game when they play against this quarterback. Beautiful, long throw down the field for the big completion. They bring in an extra defensive back. They'll go shotgun here. Looking to scramble. Makes a move and he's free. From inside the red zone. And now, on first down, they'll go back to the air. Scanning the field. That time I give all the credit on that sack. I got to give it to the secondary. It is truly a coverage sack. Nowhere to throw the football, so the quarterback keeps holding on to it. And look what happens. The defense gets there. Look at the cushion they have off of these receivers. They widen out on that defensive front here before the snap. Looks like they're in press coverage here. Second and long. And he wants to throw it across the middle. Airtight coverage. Incomplete. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. The quarterback has his team's attention good, here. Good, good. Takes the stab from the shotgun. The quarterback throws the pass. When you have an offense like this that just keeps getting first downs, not only are they move it in scoring position, but they're giving their defense a lot of rest. Look out, the defense is showing a blitz here. That defensive front looks impenetrable. Here on the goal line, he'll go. As good as it gets, touchdown. Well, that score ties the game up. Now on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. Get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. Out of the shotgun formation. He's looking to the right here on this throw. So from two yards out, they get it across and secure two extra points. The Raiders ready to return the kickoff. Brought 
to the ground. The Raiders get ready to start their drive. Two tights for this play. First and ten. Working that left side, and it's knocked down. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. Offense lines up here. Second and ten. Eyeing that left side. The pass is incomplete. There was no one open. And what you do in man-to-man -man defense sometimes, get up there and disrupt the wide receiver. Disrupt his rhythm. Disrupt the timing. And what do you get? Another incompletion. Third down here, offense trying to pick up the first. Play action, fake, looking to throw. The defense gets a sack. Quarterback made a big mistake that time. Don't carry out the play action fake when you know you're under pressure. He tries to do it, it results in a sack. The punter awaits the snap. Fifteen minutes down, 45 minutes to go. And you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The punt team is in place and ready to perform. Ball's loose. Well, that's nothing but just, uh, that, that's just luck. That's all you can say. You're the return team. They fumble the football. It bounces out, and they get it back. they lucky there. The defense comes out of the dime. First and ten. McCoy now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. Well, that was a nice run that time off nice tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? Second and two. Surveys. Breaks another. And here he goes. Knocked out of bounds. Split backfield here. The D line shifts to the right. Drop back, shotgun formation. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Oh, we've got an injured player on the field. Hard to tell exactly what the injury is, Jim, but I could just tell it's the lower part of the body, and uh, you know that was a tough hit. And I just, I hope he's able to come back in the game later today. Failing to complete that one, so second down here. Handoff, heading right. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. The off-tackle run is just what it says it is. You're going to read the tackle's block and decide whether you're going to go inside or outside. Usually, this is the first running play 
every team puts in their offense when they go to training camp. Runs out of bounds. Oh, wow, another couple inches, and that would have been six points for the offense, but he just falls short. We've got an update on the earlier injury, and we're hearing now he will return to the field, so thankfully the injury was not all that serious. Yeah, it's good news to hear, isn't it? I mean, for his family, his friends, and of course, most importantly right now for the football team, they need him back out there. Play number six coming up on this drive. Here's the give to LaShawn McCoy. And he takes it across. It is a touchdown. The defense showing blitz. Lining up now for the two. Back to the running back. They put an additional two points on the board as they convert. They line up here for the onside kick. They want that football back. These DBs will not back off. It's first down as they head to the line. The formation here, shotgun, secures it with two hands. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game, uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes, they go up, they make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. He Touchdown and drawing close. What a good job by the offense driving down and getting that touchdown. Even though they're still behind, they're chipping away at this lead, keeping the pressure on their opponents. Raiders ready for action. Breaks another tackle. Breaks free. He's taken out of bounds. The Eagles are getting set for their next possession. First down here from the gun. And he's taken down. The offensive line that time had no idea this cornerback was coming on the blitz. He timed it perfectly, and the speed and the talent to get there, and he gets the sack on the QB. Snap back to the quarterback, out of the gun. Another sack. What a job gets in there for the second straight play, gets the sack. He is just so big, fast, and strong, hard to block this guy one-on-one. -on -one. From the shotgun. He'll fire it out to the left. Ball's thrown incomplete. Great coverage there by the defense. There's a difference. When you play zone, you drop back and you watch the quarterback and you react to the football. When you're playing man-to-man, -man, All you're worried about is where that receiver goes. You try to shadow him, look for the football, and try to make a play. Hey, run, run, run. 
and the defense will use one of its timeouts right here. Hey, how about this decision? They're not going to punt it. They're going to try to pick up the first down. Hey, let's go. Base 24. Base 24. Hey, 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 look. Gun. Gun, gun. Right to the head. Looking across the middle, that ball has been picked off. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. That's a whole bunch of receivers lined up on one side for this play. Asamoah picks off that pass. Shove to the sideline. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. Base 24. Offense Base lines up here. Now first and ten. And they get to him at the 45. Gun, gun, no game. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. Second down and 11. Knocked away incomplete. When you're going against a good quarterback and wide receiver in the NFL now, one of the ways to stop it is tight man-to-man -man coverage. You against him. There's the quarterback barking out new signals. The Hands offense up, now needs ball. to pick up the first here on third down after that incompletion. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Eagles now moves the chains. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. The quarterback's hollering out instructions. First down and 10. LaShawn McCoy takes the handoff. Two minute warning. Split backfield here. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Look at the hand signals he's given to the receiver outside. The Eagles get a first down. Touchdown. I give all the credit to the wide receiver here. What a route. Pulled the defender. He is wide open. Nice throw by the quarterback for the touchdown. Well, this works out about 40% of the time if you look back on history, and they'll go. And so they convert it here on the two-point drive. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick.
the safety near the line of scrimmage. Out of the gun. Going across the middle. Great coverage there on that pass attempt. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. Second down following that incompletion. The quarterback throws to the right. Staying with him stride for stride, and the pass is incomplete. Got to give the secondary credit. In this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there in another incomplete pass. Quarters formation here for the defense. Trying to work the middle of the field. Touchdown. This game is tight. Man, what a touchdown there for the offense. The quarterback just fires that football in there. Look at the defenders around the receiver, but the receiver big enough, tough enough to go up in there and make that catch. The Eagles are prepared to return to kickoff. Tyvon Branch in on that last play. The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. They come to the line and it's first down. Airing it out. No room to complete that one. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position knocks it down. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. The quarterback's calling something out. Boy, they saw something on the offense. It caught their attention. Look at the defensive line. They're all shifting to the right. Looks to his left. With two hands, he has it. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you've got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. Look out here. They're going to blitz. They're all packing the line of scrimmage. From the gun. Vicks looking long. He brings it in. In zone bound, and he's got the touchdown. Well, you got a lead. You drive down the field. You score a touchdown. Now we're going to find out if the other team can stay patient or will they panic. They're going to the hurry-up offense, and they're back to the line quickly. Extra point is good. And following the extra point, the Eagles lead by 10. Eagles getting set for the kickoff. This kick will stay on the ground, avoiding a big return. Not giving up another inch. Raiders getting ready now to start their drive. First down here. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Darius Hayward Bay with the catch. Touchdown. That'll close the gap. There's a nice touchdown there, and you chip it away at that lead. Try to get into the minds of the opponent. Will they get tight? Did you hear the word choke? Yeah, I think they could be choking over there on the other side. Look out. He was trying to get an early jump on the play, but the referee caught him in the neutral zone. Sebastian Janikowski lining up for the kickoff. This big return's going to set up his team in excellent field position.
Eagles come onto the field now for this next series. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Vicks looking long. The defense did not give up an inch. That's what you have to do as a defensive back. You got to wait to the last second. Wait till the receiver uses his hands. And once they go up, put your hand in between them and knock that football down. What a play. Hey, let's go. Offense lines up here. Gun, gun, gun. Hey, let's the quarterback go. has his nice team's boy. attention Please here. They'll go shotgun here. Looking to the right side and throwing. It's off the mark. It's incomplete. Number 18. The intended target on the clock. Third down. Here, a split backfield. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him Hanson. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down, keep those chains moving, give yourself three more opportunities. First down. Offense ready for the snap. There's the quarterback barking out new signals. First and ten. Running away from the sack. The defense gets the sack. That's an excellent job by the defense. Just gets quick penetration in there. Hits the quarterback and gets the sack. That clock keeps moving. What a job by the defense in this situation. The quarterback's hollering out instructions. Defense comes to the line, ready to pounce on that quarterback one more time. Can they get another sack right here? Looks around, under fire all day. What a job by the defensive player. Second straight play, he has got a sack. And what you have to do on the offensive side, change it up. Use your running back. Help out the offensive line. It's apparent they cannot block this guy one-on-one. -on -one. Eagle, eagle. Gun, Quarterback sees gun, something gun. in his defense. He wants to take advantage hey, go, of. Nice Look at the hand signals nice he's 20, given nice to the receiver 20. outside. Gun, gun, gun. Takes the stab from the shotgun. Trying to work that left side. Right where it had to be. Gets past the first wave. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. Play number six coming up on this drive. First and ten. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Gets his feet down right near the chalk. Nice job that time getting that extra yard and getting that first down. This offense methodically just marching down the field. The quarterback mixing things up at the line of scrimmage. Out of the shotgun formation. He'll interception. In on the stop. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position and they made the interception. Defense respecting the deep ball, playing way off the receivers. This will be the last play before halftime.
So that's going to do it for the first half. Eagles are up in this one. We're back here now in this one, where the Eagles lead by three. All right, Phil, the first half's in the books. Give us a little analysis of that first half. Nothing like a close NFL game. You can tell when you watch it, the teams are into it. They came in physically rested and prepared. Emotionally, they're ready to play. The game plans are good. So we, what have we seen here in the first half? A lot of hard hitting, a lot of hustle. It's close. Let's see who can win in the second half. The Raiders ready to take over the football. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Spins away from the tackle. And the tackle is made at the 41. They're going to the hurry up. Back to the line. Blitz is in the air. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. And the give to Darren McFadden. Good piece of tackling. When you see a long run like that, you know what it does? It just breaks the will of the defense. In the NFL, it's all about passing. We see all these wonderful things. But when it comes down to it, who can win the war up front? And it's intercepted by Asamoah. Breaks free, has some space to work with. Puts up six. What a catch, what an interception. And not only that, take it all the way back for a touchdown. You talk about the plating for an offense. Oh, shoot, that, that gets close to making him quit. Now the offense in the hurry up. And the point after is good. And after that extra point, the Eagles lead by 10. They're lining up here for the onside kick. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Raiders getting set now for their next series. I smell blitz. Something we've seen from the safety before. Ready to pounce on the snap. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. Well, that looks like an upper body injury, Jim. I think we both can tell that. And uh, now the question is, how bad is it? Uh, you just never know. Watch the safety. He's creeping up. The corner step back. Now first and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Reaches in, and that pass is incomplete. That time, the man-to-man -man coverage won. The quarterback had to make a perfect throw. He didn't. Incomplete pass. Quarters formation here for the defense. Drop back, shotgun formation. That catch will extend the drive. Anytime you get in the red zone, you want to punch it in there and get seven points. Uh, they're being dominated today. They're down more than seven, but don't worry about it. Score here and just keep playing. Defense crowding the line of scrimmage. Look out, this could be a blitz. The offense coming to the line inside the opponent's 20. Safety valve time. Going to be a tackle for a loss. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not settle for a field goal? The 
look at the safety here, moving up at the last moment. The quarterback throws to the right. The defense had that one covered. Incompletion by the quarterback that time. It was good, tight, man-to-man -man coverage. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Looking to the right side and throwing. And almost picked off. Jim, the coaches tell us the same thing every week about defenses. Can we hold them to field goal tries and not give up the touchdowns? Here we are. They got more than a seven-point lead. Can you hold them till field goal try? Well, we'll find out. And he drives it through for the field goal. We see it more and more. Long field goals by these kickers in this league now. They are strong. And they can kick it from a long way out. Backed up. Gun, gun, gun. First down and ten. Throwing now to his left. Inhales the pass. He steps out. Well, he knew he wasn't going to make it in the end zone if he just kept running. So what does he do? The right thing. He dives and just comes up a few inches short of the touchdown. The defense at this point, trying to keep him out of the end zone. Runs it across. Touchdown. When you got a lead, you march down the field, and you add on that lead with a touchdown, it's fun to watch the other team. Will they stay patient, or will they panic? My bet is they'll panic. They're going to bypass the point after and try to pick up the two-point conversion. He gets so from two yards out, they get it across and secure two extra points. The Raiders ready to return the kickoff. Here's the kick, and this one's just a little squib kick. And he is brought down at the 39. The Raiders come onto the field for their next series. Corners are backing off here. Corners formation here for the defense. The formation here, shotgun. He makes the catch. When a quarterback can run, he usually takes one guy out of pass coverage. Look at the spy that time on the quarterback. That opens up the passing lanes. Good throw and catch. First down coming up from the gun. And he wants to throw it across the middle. That brings the play to an end. Well, anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they still, they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence moving forward. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Snap back to the quarterback, out of the gun. Scores the touchdown. Uh, it's a good touchdown by the offense there. And, you know, and what it's done, it's gotten this game closer. Gives them confidence, and confidence is a dangerous thing. We'll see if they can keep moving forward after this. Inside of the uprights. They want the football back as they line up now in an onside kick formation. Looks like they've recovered the onside kick. Raiders get ready to start their drive. First down on the way. Screen play is on. 
swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. Wasting little time. Well, it was man-to-man -man coverage. Bad job by the defense. The defensive back so slow, no chance of keeping up with the wide receiver. Second down and a long way to go. The quarterback throws the pass. You are not going to be an accurate quarterback, of course, when you're under this kind of this kind of pressure. Doesn't even have time to set his feet. Another throw offline. Third down on the way from the shotgun. Looking across the middle, fumble. He's brought to a halt. There's always a rule on the offensive side when the football is fumbled. Little guys pick it up, fat guys fall on it. Don't try to pick it up if you're one of the fat guys. That time they get it done and recover their own fumble. sure why they're going to go for it at this point, but they are. They're not going to punt. Darius Hayward Bay with the catch. What a job by the quarterback, finding a way to throw that football and pick up another first down. They are marching down the field right now. This play set up by the long gainer. Stands in the pocket. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. That time it was an easy completion for the quarterback on the play-action pass, and it fools the defense because look how aggressive the offensive line is. They sold the play to the defense, and the quarterback took advantage. ready to take advantage of this golden opportunity from the red zone. The quarterback will hand it off. A lot of ways where the offense can go this time. They can run it or throw it, and even if they score, they're still going to be down, but it's always great to execute the play the right way. Play number six coming up on this drive. We'll run it with him again. Wasting no time now for this next play. Jim, I think this is a blitz. Look how close everybody is to the line of scrimmage. Looking to the right here on this throw. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. A timeout charge to the offense. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Out of the gun. Touchdown. And this game just got a whole lot more interesting. Tight ends are more valuable when you get close to the goal line because they can use their body and push off and get open that way to score touchdowns. Nice job that time. But the Tight end. Lining up now for the two-point conversion from the gun. 
looking for an open receiver on the right. That hurts. The two-point try is denied. Number three has his pass ball incomplete. The Eagles are prepared to return the kickoff. And Tyvon Branch has the tackle. What a difficult spot to be in from here. Hey, how about that? The defensive line, everybody's shifting to the left. I think they're expecting a run. Ball's on the ground. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down, and he's in pain. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. The quarterback's calling something out. The safety up in the box here. He'll fire it out to the left. The quarterback throws it on the mark. Well, when you want to spy the quarterback, that's great. You might stop him from running, but look at the open people down the field. Good throw and catch by the quarterback. It's been all about touchdowns today as we welcome you back to the action. Some good news on the injury. It does not appear to be as serious as we first thought, and he is expected to get back into this game. Yeah, he's going to come back in. I mean, that's good news for him. I don't know if the team's too happy about it because he's playing awful. But, you know, if he gets back out there, maybe he can change things around. Play clock's running down. was a big gainer now it's time to back it up they're going back up top challenging the defenders to the right side eagles in the end zone terrible job by the defense lack of hustle bad tackling you name it they allowed the short throw and catch to go all the way down the field for a score They'll get set, looking to convert on this two-point try. The D-line all talking. I think they're expecting run. That's why they're shifting to the left. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Scans the field. They will not find a way into the end zone, so they'll only get six points out of the trip. They're lining up for the onside kick. They want to get the ball back. The receiving team has the recovery. The Raiders are getting set for their next possession. They face first down. They'll go shotgun here. Palmer looking down the field. And it's thrown incomplete. Number 12, the intended target on the play. Second down.
Second down here. Takes the stab from the shotgun. Going across the middle. No separation at all. Incomplete. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football. And it leads to another incomplete pass. Offense lines up here. Out of the shotgun formation. The quarterback throws to the right. No one was open. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. This is not what you would call airtight coverage at the snap of this ball. How about this? They're trying to pick up the first down on fourth down for getting the punt. They failed to convert, and now a change of possession. That was a terrible job that time by the offense. The head coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Uh, the play is there. The players just did a terrible job of executing. It's first down as they head to the line. Steps back to throw, trying to work the middle of the field. No way that would be completed. Got to give the secondary credit. In this passing league now, it's hard to make plays, but a good play there and another incomplete pass. They've come out in the dime package. Second down and ten. Trying to find an open man. And he's thrown to the ground. Outside linebackers who can get to the quarterback, they are a rare breed in the NFL because it takes talent, size, speed, everything to do it as a linebacker. And we saw it that time on display. in the pocket no time to even look up he's sacked again there's a couple ways to get to the quarterback run over the tackle or run around him it doesn't matter as long as you get the sack the quarterback has his team's attention here looking to the right side and throwing a takeaway Spinning out of trouble. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. I think you can just tell by the body language and the way he's acting. That is an upper body injury. Hope it's not severe. We'll let you know as soon as we find out. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Darren McFadden will run with it. He's going to be tackled right around the 46-yard line. Time for the hurry-up offense. Second down following the run. Good job here by the quarterback. He doesn't like what he sees on the defensive side, so he is changing the play to the receivers by giving him hand signals. Now about that injury we saw earlier in this game I'm happy to report it looks like he will be getting back into action today yeah it's good news that he's coming back in this game I think the big question is you and I'll watch it we'll see if he's still the same player once he comes back in the pass play fails to work and now it's third down. Raiders now move the chains. That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Reaches in, swats it away. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. They make the play, and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback.
No bump coverage here. Corners backing up. Nobody but the quarterback in the backfield here. He's looking. Asamoah picks off that pass. And he's pushed out of bounds. What a terrible job by the quarterback. But nobody's open. Tries to force the pass. And look, what's it turn into? An interception. There's the quarterback barking out new signals. First down here. Play fake here. Looking down the field. I'm not going to blame the offensive line. They did their job. But the problem was the secondary. They were all over the receivers. Nowhere to, for the quarterback to throw it. That is truly a covered sack. They bring in the extra tight end. The throw to the left. He had no time to get set. Hold on a minute. There's an injured player on the field. Well, that's going to hurt him tomorrow. There's no doubt about it. When you get hit like that, you're going to feel some of that pain tomorrow. But the good news is... I think he's going to be okay, and once he gets a little um, uh, situated there, I think he'll be back in the game. They send the tight end in motion. This defensive front shifts wide to the right here, anticipating a run that way. They motion the receiver around to the other side. He'll throw it over the middle. A tackle that had to be made. Set up for a down. This team, one of the better tackling teams in the NFL, and they play the situation perfectly. They give up the short completion. They come up and make the tackle. Now we have a fourth down. Drop back, shotgun formation. The Eagles get a first down. Stop the play right there. That was a nice job by the quarterback reading the defense. Nobody open down the field. He throws it short, and look what happens. Yards after the catch. Good job by the guy catching it and getting those extra yards. We saw an injury early in this game, and now we're starting to hear he should be able to return before this one's over. So that's some good news. Yeah, it is good news to him, his family, all the friends, and, of course, the, the fans uh, here in attendance today, they're going to be happy because he has been playing awfully well. The quarterback's hollering out instructions. If they're going to have any chance at all here late in the fourth, the defense must make a big stop and give the ball back to the offense. Nice job that time by the defense. Pressure on the quarterback. He does not have time to find an open guy, and it results in an incompletion. Here they come. Play number six coming up on this drive. Quarterback sees something in his defense he wants to take advantage of. Look at the hand signals he's given to the receiver outside. Running away from the pressure. And he wants to throw it across the middle. Well, that's a good job by my man. Really good effort. Gets outside the pocket. and But, boy, once he gets outside the pocket, that's a terrible throw. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Working that left side, airtight coverage, incomplete. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position, nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football, and it leads to another incomplete pass. This will be the eighth play of this drive. 
The formation here, shotgun. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Another first down by the offense, and the happiest guys on the field or off the field right now is the defense. They are getting rested up on the sidelines. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. First and ten. Quarterback tosses it to the outside. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple yards. Gain of two on the play. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the game. That is play number 10 on this drive. Second down and seven. Another handoff. Now makes the move to the right. He steps out. You got to keep your offense in line and aggressive. So you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short game, it served a purpose. Will be the 11th play of the drive. Quarterback dropping back, looking to get the feet planted. It's a touchdown. Well, we're talking about some of the fastest humans on earth, and we take into account you can't touch them or breathe on them. That's how they're able to get open and make so many catches. The Eagles for the extra point. The point after try is in the books. Following the extra point, the Eagles lead by 15. They line up here for the onside kick. They want that football back. Raiders getting ready now to start their drive. Hey, the offense has a chance to do something with this drive. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Well, the quarterback can't get him open. He threw to the right guy that time, but the coverage was so good by the defense, uh, nowhere to get the completion. The corners retreating after the incomplete pass it brings up second down the quarterback that ball is going the other way they bring him to the turf nice job of the defense that time in position 